Hey, welcome back to Flame Broil, folks. Uh, looks like we're in the Cataclysm now. Um, continuing with Flame Broil, hopefully quickly getting to level 90. Um, yeah, I had to get, I had to, took a short break from it. Um, just to get up, built up some more uh, rested time, which I, looks like, let's see, how much did I get here? According to the add-on, I got enough to get basically another whole level and a half just about or more which is good yeah took a break for about a week and a half now we're not going to do the the vzgg or one we're going to go do mount hyjal which is this one i forgot where i got this from where is this all right so i had to get transportation over here to mount hyjal all right all right i think this is the guy I don't know what I do is talk to him. Yeah, could you please send me to the moon glade, homie? Yeah, okay. Alright, then you just talk to a night elf chick, which is kind of weird for a horde guy to be doing that, but alright. Fly to Hydra using uh, blah 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 and speak to blah blah blah. Okay. Since I've done these quests like a billion freaking times with my other characters, this is really not going to be all that fun or exciting for me. Um, so I'm not going to show a whole lot of it for you guys, but um, I will show some uh, some questing footage because I imagine um, I think there's really only about what five dungeons or six dungeons or something like that for uh, the leveling process in uh, Cataclysm. So oh, look at that, it's a rare Blaze Wing. Oh well. I won't be able to get to him. Plus he's 81, I'll probably die horribly. I don't have any Cataclysm gear. I know a lot of people go, they go to the auction house and they buy um, upgrades, but I am going to try and rough it, which probably means I might die a few times, but uh, oh well. Then you see Deathwing, but you're already dead, Deathwing. You're already dead. I'm going back on the way back machine here. You're, you're dead. You're dead. Yes, you're dead. Oh, and you too. I kill you every week, in fact. My. Oh, jeez. My paladin. Yes. Goodbye, guys. Okay, so the official start of questing. Uh, we're gonna talk to Yasara. We're gonna pick up those two quests and open up the flight path, which really doesn't matter because I think you open up the portal here once you go here once anyway. So it doesn't quite matter. Okay, Hydro Burns, yeah. Speak the Mount Furion at the place and some place. And, all right, that's no problem. I can do that. And I will go up here and talk to these two schlubs. It's Scalding Elementals. And Juniper Berries, all right. Well, how did I know this was going to be the quest. I should have known. Yeah. I forgot the rotation on this guy. Stupid. It's been so long. It feels like it's been so long. I mean, really, it has been for me for about a week. You guys saw what? <laughs> a couple, several episodes in a row. So far, not too, he's not having too much problem. I do remember some of my other people that didn't get the gear from Lich King, uh, you know, didn't get geared up. They had problems in this zone and with these first few quests here. So, yeah, I was, um, I'm hoping I'm not going to have the same problem with this guy. I don't think I will. So far, no. It's just becoming a little smoother. And what is this? Oh, the juniper berry crap. And then you give them to these guys and they turn in on. Uh, I will, but as soon as I gotta clear this dude out first here. Uh, can't see nothing. A little help here, fairy dragon. A little help. Uh, see, now I am taking a little bit of damage here. 
Right, there you go. Let's talk to this guy here. You want some juniper berries? Here you go. Look for the evil one now. Yes. Yes, I will look for you. Where is he? There he is. Where'd he go? Oh, there he is. He's still there. Oh, taste the rainbow. Oh, nice. And another one. Ooh, yes. That's uh, that's proging pretty, pretty often. I like that. All right, any more juniper berries and uh, killing more of these stone dudes. All right. Okay, let's turn in on these babies. All right. Uh. Oh, they're actually gonna give me something with male and intellect on it. Awesome. They really need to go back to these older quests and get us some better gear quicker because this is the one class combination that we're like the only ones, the only class spec that uses mail with intellect on it. So, yeah, they really need to go back to the old quest and make it easier for us to get stuff. So this here will give us a huge boost. Item level 272 from 174. So that is awesome. And now I'm friendly with my, my guild. Which, yes, I did pick a guild, and it's my guild. <laughs> so, yeah, in case you were wondering. Uh, but I don't get nothing here. But the item level is so huge, and haste and mastery probably would be nice for my guy. Anyway, I might actually put this on if they let me. Oh, oh that's the next quest. Duh. Speak is the uh, blah, blah, and the blah, blah, blah. Yeah, okay. Where's that? Oh yes, it's that place up in the corner. I, I'm so used to these. Okay. Yeah. You just go in here, you kill three guys, and then yeah, summon the dragon. It's pretty easy. In fact, you don't even really need to summon the dragon or kill all three guys if uh, you can get in far enough. I can't remember. Nah. Yeah, you gotta you gotta probably get in a little more. And I am taking some. Oh, I didn't equip that stuff. That was stupid of me. That was stupid though. Let's see here. I'm gonna equip both things. And where's the other thing? Oh, that's right. I only got the one thing. Yeah, right, that's fine. Ah, see, I didn't need to do it. Just inch forward, and uh, I'll go in and do the rest of the quest for you. There he goes. He torches them, and you don't even have to do anything. Thank you, sir. Thank you very much. All right, yeah, I will put on those agility pants, even though they're kind of useless for me. That's fine. Uh, are these? Sometimes I, I wonder whether I should save stuff for transmogging. Uh, these old pants. What about these old ones? These are kind of neat. I don't know if I'll really use them, but I'll, maybe I'll save them temporarily until I... I gotta find some neat transmog thing to go after once they hit maybe around 85. Maybe that'll be a little side thing I, I do with uh, this guy. I'm not sure what if I'll go for a specific set or something. But um, yeah, I will do something. I'd like to do something before I close the series at least to get him some sort of a nice transmog of some sort. Um, at least something he can solo. <laughs> Probably not any stuff that's in a raid or whatever, but uh, we'll see. I would love to get the stuff from... Uh, Cataclysm here, some of that fire land stuff, but I don't like it. I'm not going to be able to do that solo in a raid, but uh, so okay, so on to Malfurion, and I'm also trying to hit as many uh, of these herb spots just because you get, see, 4,600, you get experience, a uh, nice big chunk of it every time you find one. Uh, but of course, you got CRZ going on here, too. That's the first time I've gone through this one with CRZ on, so we'll see how uh, things go with uh harvesting. I really haven't had any problems with that as far as if I needed stuff, you know. I really haven't been facing any bots or anything. Um, oh, I really want to stick with the one-hand shield combo. I could put this staff on temporarily, though. As you can see, not too bad once I get this one done. Kill for Twilight such and such, and She's got one for me, which you can barely see from on the really awful 
Yeah, I, I got my graphics turned down so bad that the special effects look pretty awful. Although my computer can probably handle uh, the special effects. Um, now this is finding these little staffs are what makes this difficult because they're so tiny on the ground. So I think maybe flying would be the best option here and locating them first. They're usually around these little fire areas and I'm not going to fight anything. I do remember the one over here having a lot of them. Yeah, I could see them already. Oh, come on. Dang, come on, just break the arrow. There you go, see? Bunch of them here. Yeah, I have to get rid of this guy to get the other one anyway. Oh, knock back. There you go. Thank you, sir. So I'll concentrate on these first, and if I get the other one done in the process, that's the way to go with this one. Yes, sir. Okay, turning in on those two. Nice ooh, kill. 30 unbound spirits, and do I get something from this at all? That staff, which I am debating whether I should put on at all. I probably will. Temporarily, till I get something like I want at... Ooh. Well, let's see. Put that on. I did like that shield for transmogging. So put that down there. This thing's a piece of crap. See, I, I kind of organize like stuff I'm either going to sell or keep. I put down below, and yeah, well, everyone's got their own method. Just so I don't accidentally sell it or something. All right. So what I need? Oh, and there's more. Um, the herb respawned. I must go back to the same herb. Thank you for more experience points, sir. All right. Now it's just going to those big fiery dudes and you lit this off and you need AoE damage for this, I remember that. Uh where yeah, these blazing elemental type dudes push this is this yeah, see this is the problem. Um you got guys that are not engaged all over here, so finding a group not um that are otherwise uh preoccupied here. Uh, I'll got the Look around here for this. Uh, let me pause. Uh, I see. So now this one over here, you gotta be careful with that from Baron Geddon. Baron Geddon must have broke out of uh, Molten Core. Uh, so y there are some around him. So I'm gonna try and get him. See if I can actually get him off of that. There you go. Nan use it. Said quest item, and he'll break up into smaller ones. And I. Okay, I hope that my chain lightning will knock him down before I get murderized here. Alright. Some classes have a problem with this. I remember I had some problems with this particular quest with some of my people. So was that, nine of them? Okay, I gotta find some more of these guys. So I will pause again. Oh, and there's a quest over here. And an herb. Is the herb worth getting? not worth getting killed over, that's for sure. Oh, yeah. Finkel Einhorn. Anyone remember where this guy was originally? I remember going into uh, Black Rock, what is it, Spire? And he was in the in the stomach of uh, one of that Corehound boss. I talked to him, and it was the most hilarious conversation ever. I mean, really. So now he shows up again in Black Rock Depths. Yeah, I could actually go there just to turn that in, but I'm, I'll am i probably queue up for that. There's only going to be a few dungeons in this particular uh, expansion, like I said before, so. Grab that before Baron Giddon gets us. Yay, experience. Alright, there was another one on the outside, but i got to be careful. He's going to vanquish her near him. Right, hopefully that won't provoke the other guy. Uh... Into my area there. That knocks them mostly dead. And there, they're, they're dead. Good. Good. Well, I won't torture you guys, but we can watch the rest of this. But Okay. Turning in. 
29,000. Uh, channel the flames. Oh, that. This one could be messy if you're not careful. See, now I could use this as a maze if I gotta find me uh, a good um, shield, though, to go with it. So I might save that one. That's more of a healer one because it's got spirit on it, but well, I guess I could use it anyway. Beggars can't be choosers. And anything's better than uh, nothing. Alright, so I this is you gotta be extremely careful on this. And I like being near this thing here because at the end when he puts that thing on you. Yeah, I remember I, I play Molten Core every week, so looking for some drops for my Paladin. And you're gonna get out of here because uh, he's doing the thing and you're taking damage. Run out of that stuff. All right, hit him again. Yay! Four, five, six. Let's go. Die you! It's gonna go any second now. Let's start berserking. Wow! Uh, run away! Run away! Come on! All right, here we go. And it should be the moment of truth. Ah, uh, yay. 20. Okay. Final act of revenge made you a living bomb, just like he does in Molten Core. Okay. Stand right under this so he won't take too much falling damage, because you'll hit the thing on the top. Come on. Boink. Ooh. There you go. Cool. Okay, yeah. I just turned in. I'm going to keep this, so I'll keep it in the middle here. I'm not going to equip it until I get a shield. No that makes sense to equip it right now. Speak to a uh, blah 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 and blah blah blah. Okay. Where is that? Oh yeah, I remember this one over here. It's that that's the dragon that it will later on, spoiler alert, will um betray you when you do the molten front stuff. Which I won't be doing with this character, obviously. No point. I already got the mount from it. There's really not much else to get except for maybe a couple of novelty items. Alright, so you go in here, he tells you to go over to the thing to get the prisoner, right? Scout, blah blah blah, wants the blah blah blah, okay. Oh, no, 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 that's the next one right after this one, I think. Ah, see, I was wrong, I was wrong, I was so wrong. Okay, what do we need? We need to find the scout, that's right here. Alright, I think they tell you to do something with the ogre, right? Yeah, you gotta hit one, kill one of the ogres to get uh, some kind of key from them. I think that is it. Give me my key, you. Yay. I got me my key. I let out this uh, night elf, which for a horde person probably isn't very good. Return to blah, 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 the ruins of blah, blah, blah. Okay. It's right over here. I will do that. Alright, dragon. Too bad I can't kill the dragon now because uh, they're going to betray us. Uh, speak to Captain uh, the Den. Yeah, that's the one I was thinking of. The Den. And I think you go into the Emerald Dream to go in here or something. Yeah, I forget. Oh, I bet you they're going to make another heroic class with these types of, uh, these chicks. I was always wondering, like, what, what heroic class will they do next? They might not do anymore. That's my guess, but. I don't know. All right, so you just, I'm just going to walk through here, and, uh, when you get to the, uh, the inside part, you, uh, you have to escort a prisoner. All right, Fandral Staghelm. That'll be the prisoner we transport. Um, yeah, I'm gonna go inside the Emerald Dream. So yeah, then we just have to kill these night terrors on the way there, which are fairly simple, I would think. Yeah fairly simple.
And look what I just picked up. Uh, an offhand. Even though it's not a shield, I could probably use this just as just as easily. So if I combine that with that. And it's 283, not 270. Whatever the heck that is. All right, let's get rid of this shield or staff. Uh, put that on, and we'll put this on with it. I like the look of a shield better, but I don't mind having an offhand. I guess that's okay. And we're almost out of here. Just one more guy to kill, I think, on the way there. And we got. Uh... Yeah. All right. Good. Let's go. Let's get out of this ugly green land. So if they ever do an Emerald uh, Emerald Dream expansion, which everyone says they're going to do, uh, I hope the whole darn game isn't just like we'll stick some ugly green kind of film over the the, the, the camera <laughs> like they're doing here. I mean, I guess it's okay for some sequences, but having an entire expansion like this would kind of be a little annoying. Uh, if we get anything worthwhile here, come on, man. Got to give me something. Well, I guess not. Let's turn in. Uh, speak to Yuzara. I gotta go back to Yuzara. Oh well. All right. What do you want to tell me, Yuzara? Oh, what happened here? Friendly with Mount Hyjal, or Guardians of Hyjal. Return of the Ancients. Speak to Umaluma. Why are my halls run? Oh, some kind of thingies. Yeah. I don't think I could buy anything from the... Oh, I could get the tabard. Not that I'm really going to farm this reputation anyway. It's not really worth it. Yeah, all this stuff really isn't usable until level 83. Um, that wouldn't be a, that would be a nice back item. Yeah, actually, I can use it at level 83 if I get to honored, which I will probably get. What about this? That too. That's revered though. Yeah, it's definitely not going to be able to use much of this um, with this spec. Oh, also looks like there's another quest back here. Grab it quickly. Jaluna. Okay, that's good. Alright, I think guys, I will end this episode and um, I don't know yet. I guess I'll keep going with some Mount Hydro ones. And I'll just maybe jump ahead a little bit. Or I'll queue for a dungeon when I'm bored. And uh, maybe we'll end up getting stuck with that uh, Vizier one, the water one, water world one. Or perhaps Black Rock Depths will get into that. I don't know. But um, we'll see. I'm not sure what I'm going to do. But uh, I will catch you next time. Better episode anyway. Adios.